Hello, I am Jody Wolf, and you're watching Exposed today, March 9, 2013, 11.05 p.m. in Birmingham, Alabama. And topic, what I want to say is in relation to the Middle East, 1400 year war that's about to come to a head. Um, so I won't even tell you about that again. I just want to tell you that be prepared for something that you never thought you would see. You're not going to see a scrimmage here and there. You're going to see the whole Middle East on fire. And this is going to spread through their European community and on in through the Russian bloc countries right on into Russia. And then it's going to exceed right on to the east. And it's going to touch China. It's going to touch some of those countries there. Now, the alien problem that we have in our country with the Hispanics, you think we're the only ones having it. No, they're having it just as bad there. And, and from Italy all the way down through Ireland with Muslims coming as bad as we're having it. And what is happening, the world is beyond repair. It can't be. There's one way that God said, if you turn from your wicked ways and you come to me and call me, I'll heal your land. But guess what? That's not going to happen because the leaders we have that count are all bought. They are bought. They have been paid off. So they're not going to call on God. In fact, the moment they took that money, they probably lost their chance to call on God. But let me say this. That kettle box, that inferno, it's about to flash over. And it's going to. And... Um, are you prepared? Are you really prepared for something like that to occur? When I say prepared, what what if you, God forbid, what if you live and go right into that when you could have been gone? <coughs> Excuse me. Um, point is, I don't want to be here. I don't want to be any part of it, and I won't be. I will be in a rapture. I will be zipped out of here. As soon as the light leaves, then the darkness takes over, and you know what plays in the dark. Every evil thing that there is, to them it is dark as long as the Holy Spirit has been removed. That means they have full run and reign of the world to do as they please. And I'm speaking of Satan and all his followers, all the fallen angels that came with him. Earth is about to go into a hell that you could not imagine but you have to acknowledge it. You have to know. You have to read it. You have to understand that it's coming. It is safe for me. And when I say safe, it's okay for me to die because I know that I'm going straight to heaven. But for those who don't accept Christ, who have not, when you die, you're leaving a hell to go into a worse hell because hell is going to be on earth. You're going to have a pope, and I, I'm going to say it because it's the truth, number 312, he will be the last. Bible plainly says the church of the seven hills will be and take part of, be in and take part of overpowering and implementing their will upon the people that are on earth. 
mark of the beast and the way things are going now look at all the people that just refuse to work because the government is giving them handouts that's what put the Jews under the thumb of the Pharaoh a long time ago and it didn't happen only then there were other times when Jews had mercy on people they did not fulfill what God asked them to do and those very people they kept alive grew into an army just like the Muslims do when they go into countries and then they took over the Jews and enslaved them first started out by helping them out a little bit then help them out a lot then time to pay up you owe me don't have anything well give me your house next thing you know give me your land next thing you know give me your sheep give me your goats next thing you know I right, then go to work for me you're gonna have to work for me 12 16 hour days and I will pay you enough wage to buy one day's food that's coming it's biblical that is coming upon earth is coming upon every nation in this world soon look at it it can't be repaired we're beyond being repaired the world can't be fixed no more what do you print money we're still printing a B in a day. And, and what is it? A, a, a thousandth of a penny. If you count the billions. Well our dollar is probably worth in the 60 cent range. Or a little more. But you know. In a year they keep printing. We'll be in a 30 to 40 cent range. You think food's high now. You just wait. Look. you know what's going on you see you see the world in disarray you see that things aren't good and, and just know that they're not going to improve and that's why God says I have not appointed judgment to my own when he says my own talking about those who accepted Christ he said, my own, not my chosen. Those who accepted Christ, we belong to Christ. He's going to come and take us home. God's chosen people will be protected by God. He will be at the forefront of any war that comes against Israel. He will protect and preserve the remaining Jews in Israel until the three and a half year point of the tribulation then Michael will come and take them out into Petra a city in the uh, country of Jordan biblically Jordan that part belongs to Israel anyway but on paper it's not but biblically it is so is part of Iraq so is part of Syria all of Lebanon all of Hamas, all the Gaza Strip, all that belongs to Israel. But anyway, look, if, if you're not ready, it's going to be very hard to accept Christ later. Right now, it's free. It doesn't cost you nothing but 10 seconds. Go into a closet and ask the Lord to forgive you that you've sinned. Doesn't mean you're not going to sin again, but that second you're forgiven. Past, present, future sins. You're under the protection of Jesus Christ. Right then, right there, he's got you. He never lets you go, and you will be taken out when the evil, the Antichrist, is released to do his horrible, dirty work on this world by destroying as many people as he can. i got to close I don't have any more time Jody Wolf by the way John 316 Jody Wolf exposed